Uh, what is it? There we go, man. Net. Oh, there you go, dude. Yeah, there we go. Yes. morning jigs and bigs family it is a friday morning it's uh it's not too early it's just about 8 30 and uh i'm running out to my storage unit right now because i have one hell of a weekend lined up for you guys just uh, about four hours or so i am heading up to burlington vermont with uh queen beef my uh my wife to go see one of our favorite bands perform uh at a park right alongside Lake Champlain in uh, in beautiful Burlington, Vermont, and uh, that band is the Flaming Lips. We're really excited about going. We're gonna have ourselves a great time. So my uh, my wife and I we're gonna go see this show, and I, you know I said we're gonna be right there at Champlain, you know. And I know that there's some I got I'm not 100 percent sure, but there's some huge qualifying event that's going up there now. And I'm like, but I, it would be it would be crazy for me to go all the way up and not take a day to fish. So we're gonna be up for two nights. Friday night and Saturday night, we're staying there. We're coming home on Sunday. And uh, I called old Binya Outdoors and uh, said to him, Hey, bud, how do you feel about getting on the water, taking the boat out on Champlain uh, on Saturday morning? So that's the plan. We're going to be fishing on Saturday morning. I'm going to take you guys along with for that. And, uh, and then my wife and I are just going to have a great time. Now, I don't know how much of that stuff that I'm going to be vlogging necessarily, like, you know, going out for dinner and all that stuff. Uh, but I'm going to try to take you guys along the way. And this is going to be kind of a different sort of video, but will include some fishing. And it should be pretty cool. I have a few uh, items I want to make sure to have on hand. Uh, actually, some of the camping and like overlandy stuff, because I think it will make the experience hanging out at the drive-in. And that's the thing. We're going to see uh, Deadpool and Wolverine uh, at the, at the drive-in. So I'm stoked for that. She's stoked for that. We're both Marvel sluts and, uh, can't get enough. And especially the whole Deadpool franchise has just been huge. Uh, we've been really into it since the very first film came out X number of years ago. So we'll see you guys. Uh, we're probably going to see you next time in Vermont. time with my wife she enjoyed herself immensely uh, we decided we'd grab some dinner on the way home and uh, we just kind of uh, chilled in our uh, our spot um, waiting on Mike right now waiting on Binya got the boat hitched up um, and uh, I think we're I think we're doing all right um, there's two public launches nearby both are like crazy close and uh, I think the one that we're, we're trying to hit is only about a mile and a half away from where, we're at, where I'm at now so uh, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, should be interesting, man. Uh, we're going to go ahead and uh, give it everything we got. Um, there was a, uh, I believe, a BASS qualifying event that happened here this week. So these fish, I'm sure, are uh, beat the hell up. So, I mean, hopefully they've got room for a little bit of uh, my particular brand of bullshit. Uh, 
us. We're here living that Lund life. By the way, dude, you look great. You're fucking losing some fucking weight, yeah, aren't you? 50 pounds, dude. Shut the fuck up, buddy. I needed to. I had to fit in the kayak. Nice fucking job. I can job. carry more gear in the kayak if I have less weight on me. I, I need to start fucking doing the same. But anyway, uh, this is the first time my ass is on my own boat on the motherfucking Lake Champlain. The sixth great lake. A and as you can see, we're ready to record some content. So let's fucking fish and see what the fuck happens. This is exactly what I bought this rod for. Was specifically, this is a uh, this is a medium fast. Yeah, it's a six six medium fast. Yeah. Yeah. Because then when I swing too early, the rod takes another half second to load up, and then I get that like buffer built in. So I don't do it too early. Of course, we're probably chasing top water bites, but not ended because we're chasing the top water. So that's not working. Classic lure too. Fucking Zara spook. It's spooks are... I actually caught my first spook fish like three weeks ago. Oh, really? I really had, had a lot of success with it because a lot of places I fish, there's so much trash that it's not worth it. So I used to fish my spooks on my fucking frog setup like an idiot. And I've had a bunch of fucking bites, but I've lost so many fish. Which is why I was like, yeah, I'm putting together a rod that's more tuned toward this and a popper and uh you know even like a, a plopper like i thought about throwing that too i was like yeah i just kind of want to cover water you know a plopper yeah i don't know if it's like they, they got wise to them or i just maybe i don't have the confidence in it anymore so i don't fish it enough but Part of me almost thinks like a walking bait might be a good idea too. And but I also like he doesn't. He's just started like his. He was. I just I was just getting fucking bit, dude, right here. Really? Yeah. I don't know from what, but like stupid shallow, stupid shallow. Followed it in saw it and then i had to i would try to hit spot lock and i was doing too many fucking things oh yeah perch yep yep that's exactly what it is all right little ones there we go. Got fish in the boat. I mean. Hey, it counts. It counts, baby. It you saw it. Line. It crossed the, the threshold. threshold. It crossed the threshold, baby. It counts. So Skunks out of the boat. Huh? Was that yeah, it was a tiny smallie. Tiny, tiny smallie. Smallie. See, it was a small smallie. I'm going to take it, man. I'm going to. I mean. The way I look at it, there's a force field that goes around the gunnel, and if it crosses that, then that would That's what I'm saying, dude. If I take it out of the water and it's on my hook, I'll, I'm, I'm going to count that. Skunks you'll, out of the boat. You'll see it in my videos. Call that a quick release. Oh, yeah. Oh, like, look I at that. Need to, I don't even need to boat you. I'm just going to I'm gonna be more humane to you. Yeah. I'm, that's, I'm an extreme conservationist. Yeah. Here in Burlington, Vermont, that's what they're all about. I don't want to touch you. I don't want to touch you. I want to let you have your you know? coat and everything. Yeah, there's stuff over there. There's something biting that where I'm that wacky. Exactly. Done. Exactly. So I said that. I'm like, I have no idea. She was asking me about some setting and a server configuration. Now keep in mind. So we, the big thing that we sell is a e sign platform for like signing contracts, loan docs, stuff like okay, that. Okay, yep. Uh, like DocuSign is, you know, the most well known. There you go, dude. Hey, look at that. 
Another little, oh, it's a Larry. It's a upsized. It is. The first one we've, we've upsized this Larry. So, now up uh, yours. That tells me that I'm switching this out for that. <laughs> I was the uh, main uh, on come that, on, buddy. now I'm going to that. Come on, buddy, there we go. Not bad. That's Not bad. Ah, all right, let's grab the phone and we'll get some of this shit. So uh, we figured out that they're, they seem to be uh, much more shallow. You know, uh, this so far is the biggest of the day. It is the second fish. Binya, how you doing back there, bud? I'm still trying to figure out what you're catching fish on, but we'll get it. We'll, we'll figure it out. Let's go ahead and release this bastard. Thanks, buddy. Bye. But yeah, basically it was... A And the hits keep on coming. We got little smally right here. We've upsized a little bit. These are still super small fish, but we're uh, we're fishing up against this this bank right here. And then we've got this marina. We're gonna hit a bunch of docks and see what happens. But um, we got some weeds, which is good. I've been looking for that, and we'll see what we can do. Now you never saw us, and you're not gonna tell your friends a damn thing. Oh, there you go, dude. Yes. Fucking A, buddy. Yeah, dude. There you go. Hell yeah, mama. Hell oh, yeah. you came right dude. out. Dude. Now, bud. Yeah. yeah. We got the net there when we did, because he was not on the... Dude, you are the man. He was not on that. The man. Well, that comes from... Uh, that net job comes from uh, King Salmon Fishing, dude. You need you you learn how to be good on a net when you got a thirty pound king salmon right at the well, boat. That's what I'm <laughs> it's that's not. What I'm you got to like drive it in quick. Uh, on, show this fish off. Hell yeah, dude. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna, I'm gonna box. Them. Hey, you're like, good. Guys, holy. What? Guys, holy shit, guys! Look at this. Look at this fish. Beautiful largemouth. Up underneath that dock. Let me make sure. I'll stop. I'm gonna lock us right here. Wow, guys, this is beautiful. I'm gonna throw this fish in a live well. We wanna take a nice group photo. We only have a couple hours left and I'm running the aerator. Rock and roll Champlain, Vermont. What is up? Cause that's the whole thing is like my goal is that's the thing that like i said it's funny and it's it's it bugs me and it doesn't bug me at times is like yeah oh shit, dude. 
Dude, that's a big bite. Whoa. Fuck. Awesome. It's okay. Yeah, my bad, dude. It's alright, dude. No worries. You I'm actually gonna... I am gonna... That was a big pike, dude. That was an okay pike. I mean, bigger than... I guess it looked big because of the... Bigger uh, than the bass. Yeah. Yeah. Because of what we've been catching. I knew he was... Yeah, I actually hit him with a net. <laughs> is what happened there. That was definitely my bad. Yeah, dude, that was awesome, man. And I got that on video. Uh, I did too, apparently. Nice, good. But, but yeah, it's uh, yeah, that's interesting. So you're you're all going down to Cayuga to do the whole. Yeah, we're gonna go to Cayuga, and if there's if it works out. Oh yeah, baby. There you go. Oh yeah, mama. Oh shit, dude! That's a good smallie. No, that spit it's off. Off. It's off. Oh, dude, that was probably sixteen. That was a good fish, dude. That was a big. Smallie. Yeah, you could you could literally come back with real. Driving. Yeah, the drive-ins has decent. I think they have like fried bread dough and like burgers, French fries, like curly fries, like all that kind of theater and they would show like they didn't show like any new new stuff it makes you to actually move to Vermont and actually do it and then show have a little bit of financial security to my long-term goal is to get the right partner so that I can make money on it it looked big because of the uh, yeah because of what we've been catching one two three what's up guys BRB and Binya he said we uh, we caught fish. We I mean, caught fish. I ain't mad at it. You know, I mean, we got uh, what do we put in the boat today? We put in uh, largemouth, smallmouth. Uh, had a pike that uh, shook off right at the boat. I think we actually have footage of that. I'm hoping that we uh, that that made it in the video. Uh, and it was it was all, all around. It was it was really good. You know, I think. Uh, I think we had ourselves one hell of a time, but uh, Mike, we got to do this shit again, my friend. Absolutely. I actually caught my first Lake Champlain smallmouth. Believe it or not, the boy from Vermont caught his first smallmouth with the guy from Massachusetts because I usually catch largemouth out of there. So that was kind of a cool, I mean, literally my first time in Bobby's boat, first smallmouth. I mean, it's, it's pr pretty good juju to it's start out. I think we deserve chips and a soda. Absolutely. I think that's the way it's got to go. So we're gonna sign this sucker out, you guys. Thank you so much for uh, supporting the channel and uh, and watching. Remember, if you have not already subscribed, make sure to like the video if you do. Share it with your friends, and uh, we will see you guys next time we see you. See you guys. guys what a day today was I got out and did some fishing with Binya outdoors on Lake Champlain we caught some fish did we catch the Giants we hoped to definitely did not do that but uh, we had a great time with it then uh, I, I got off the water for about noon and uh, headed right back in uh, what a great place that we're staying at and uh, it's connected to a drive-in theater so that's the plan for tonight so my wife and I Polly queen beef Yay. there she is um we are uh we had decided to come downtown and uh you know maybe grab a cup of coffee meander around a little bit not only get one cup of coffee we got two we uh we stopped in at a, a spot uh vermont distillers and uh we picked up a bunch of spirits after we did a tasting in there that were really good uh, a cranberry what was it cranberry liqueur mm -hmm. cranberry liqueur and a uh Vermont, uh, cream. Vermont maple cream, which was out of this world. 
and uh, we followed that up with um, kind of meandering around. I decided what we would do is because we weren't really like hungry, you know, for like a big sit down dinner. So we decided we'd go get a couple of cocktails because, you know, sampling some liquor in a, in a distillery store uh, wasn't enough. We had gone to a little cocktail lounge called uh, Devil Takes a Holiday. And I got to tell you guys, if there was ever a cocktail lounge that sums up like the way I would put a bar together and same thing with, with Queen Beef, like the playlist was so good. The decor was amazing. The cocktails were out of this world. And the menu uh, was perfect. It was limited. Uh, we ordered a couple of like seasonal sort of items, uh, and uh, we so we we had a, a little bite there. A couple of cocktails, out of this world. We're gonna just cruise around right now, Burlington, and kind of sightsee a little bit, and then uh, head over to for tonight's drive-in uh, movie. We're gonna see uh, Deadpool and Wolverine which is pretty awesome. So, pretty stoked on that. We're going to have ourselves a great time. It's a salmon hole. It, it is a salmon hole. Good Lord. <laughs> we'll see you guys uh, tomorrow. Or maybe, maybe even later tonight. Who, know, who knows what's going to happen? <sighs> Movie time. We got uh, everything we need. We're ready to rock. Holly and I haven't done this, just the two of us, ever. We've always gone in the drive-in with the kids. And it's kind of nice to use the rig for uh, just having a good time. Well, guys. That uh, concludes our little uh, excursion to uh, the Lake Champlain area, specifically Burlington, Vermont. We had a great time. I got uh, Queen Beef right here by my side. Turn right. We're on our way home now. Um, checked out of the uh, motel we're staying at. Can't recommend it enough. It's called the uh, Starlight Inn. It's right next to the Sunset Drive-In. Same owner, proprietor. Um, we had a great time last night. We had uh, gone out downtown, went to a couple of places. We got some coffee. We walked around. We did a little liquor tasting. We ended up at a really great bar um, called Devil Takes a Holiday. Uh, and then we um, ended up back at the, um, the drive-in to watch uh, Deadpool and Wolverine. What, what did you think, honey? It was good. It was good? Yeah? Recommend it? Yeah. Um, it was really, really good. There's a... Uh, there's a lot of really, really good elements in there. Some some unbelievable laughs, and uh, just the soundtrack is exquisite. It's perfect, like every Deadpool movie is. Um, had a great time. Went back. Uh, did a little bit of editing on this video. And then we got up early this morning. We went out for breakfast at a place called The Friendly Toast, and it was absolutely out of this world. I had a Bloody Maria. My wife had a, a type of uh, a bitter mimosa, which is right up her alley. Um, had uh, I had an omelet. She had some uh, lemon curd blueberry pancakes, which just looked absolutely out of this world. And, uh, yeah, we had ourselves a great time. It was a whole lot of fun, and uh, I can't wait to come back. Fishing with Binya was, uh, you know, it was... In one mile. It was an amazing time. Um, there were no giants caught. We caught some fish. But after the week that they have just have had with the qualifying event going on up here, I can totally understand why uh, the you know biting fish were probably few and far between. If we're gonna be back, Burlington. Uh, you made a fan out of uh, Queen Beef, and uh, hey, any reason, any excuse that I can get to come up to the uh, the, the fabled Lake Champlain and uh, splash my own boat in there, I'm uh, I'm all for it. So we'll see you guys next time.